Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. We are here with the pocket letter row swap reveals. These are participants seven, eight, and nine. I'm going to quickly go through them. I say that every time. <laughs> First up, we have Candace. This is how hers come packaged. Super cute. Um, the participants had to make a pocket letter row October, November, December. If they celebrated the Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas, they could do that, or just um, October, November, December. All right, so this one is for me. Um, Candice is um, crafty underscore Candice one. The C A N D A C E spelling. I'll put it in the description box. And I just made a knot, so I'm going to have to cut it. I love these bags. Just some shreddies, yellow and white. Oh, gorgeous. All right, so she did a little Halloween, a little Christmas. All right, and we got, I want to open this. Look at this. So this is a gift on a gift. She uh, got us a little zip bag. I love zip bags. I, I just, I do. I love bags. I'm a bag lady. Look at this gorgeous, chunky dangle. How beautiful is that to hang off your purse, um, your keys. In my case, it's going to be my little charm board. How beautiful is that? That's a bead and a bead. That's cool. Never seen that. Oh, this one too. That is super cool. I love it. it has a little key, a little flower. That is gorgeous. Thank you so much. should put this. I'll do it when I turn my camera off. I have a spot where I'm keeping all of it because obviously I don't have my um, my board here. It's in my storage. Look at this chunky box. It's so cute. She's a little flower here with some um, bead trim. <sighs> Every time I record. Okay, some spam business. Let's get into her pocket letter. Oh wow, look at her beadwork. Oh my goodness. It is absolutely gorgeous and she put it on a clippy. Look at that clip, that is a super cool clip. I love it. She has a lot of uh, bead wraps here and they have little spacer things. There's little flowers. How gorgeous is this? I absolutely love it. a lot of work I don't I don't do jewelry <laughs> because it's too much work I love the uh, I don't know if this is washi tape or like a faux glitter or faux leather it's really nice look at how absolutely adorable so I have our little ghost it says only treats no tricks please so cute and he has a little uh, spider web behind him a leaf a cloth leaf and some candy corns Give thanks of a gorgeous burlap flower with a little pumpkin, a resin pumpkin, a matte pumpkin, and a glitter pumpkin. Um, and um, the cloth leaves. Now these things have a lot of dimension, so I'm surprised it even fit in the pockets. Because they are thick, thick. And then look at the Christmas. Tis the season with the hot chocolate with the cinnamon or coffee with the little vellum tag the little leaf poking out behind and a snowflake with some card candy absolutely gorgeous that is beautiful i like this iridescent where are y'all getting all this iridescent paper from did i just miss the boat i want to say so i do have this iridescent paper to be honest it's a uh, uh, it was stamping up grapefruit something or other I do have it. I just haven't used it. And then for her goodies, we have a washi tape sample, which I love because I typically don't buy washi tapes. And then when I want to use a washi tape, I'm like, oh, I don't have any. So I love washi tape samples. 
Um, oh, different shape blings. And here's her information again. This is what I meant to tell everyone to do. <laughs> because I forgot. And then here we have a little witch's hat paper clip for your day planner. And some pumpkins. It's a felt hat. I will use mine year round. So I have my, I don't have a day planner, but I'm starting to keep myself organized on like these little calendars. And how cute would that be? I'm going to, I'm going to leave that over here for my calendar. Super cute. And little pumpkins. That is really cute. Definitely check her out. She is um, crafty underscore Candace one. Now let me get to the next one. All right, so next up we have Julie, and look how hers come packaged. Everyone has their own little tag collage. Look at the bird for me. Oh, I love that guy. He has a little beanie on. That one's for me. So let's take a look here. Um, and she is um, Julie Duskins Crafting with Julie on YouTube and Instagram. Okay, let me put these back in the package. So it looks like she went with Christmas packaging. I was really interested to see what people would pick because it was, um, when the swap came out, it was the beginning of October. So I assumed people were going to pick a lot of Halloween, but we're getting a quite big of a mix. My packaging was fall, of course, because I love fall. All right, so she has some eyelash trim. Look at this guy. Hello, Snow. And she has some shreddies and some um, little craft ball things. And, oh, that's tissue paper. Okay, hold on. And I love the thread. I just was watching uh, a reveal on Brittany's channel, BB's Craft, and somebody else had put the thread in there. And it just gives it a little extra sparkle. I left the crinkling in for those of us who love crinkling. <laughs> okay. This is Merry Christmas Washi. Oh, wow. Look what she made us, guys. Christmas calories don't count. They don't. So. Legit, I always, around this time, I lose about 10 or 15 pounds just so I could gain it back at Christmas. <laughs> and you would think that, like, it's so easy for me to lose weight October and November, the beginning of December, because I know I'm just going to put it back on with Christmas cookies. And, you know, and I wish I had that throughout the year of, you know, um, that mentality that it's easy to lose weight. Like, my diet is so clean, it's not even funny. Um, start Like, starting now, probably like November 1st is usually when it starts. Like, today, you know, I ate high protein, you know, my complex carb and stuff like that, because... I want to lose weight for Christmas so I can just gain it back. <laughs> that is an amazing gift and you can use it on your Christmas cookies. Take them out the oven. It's one of those silicone nice mats. Use it as a trivet on this side. I love it. That's a thick mat. And she got these bags from Hobby Lobby because I almost bought them. <laughs> I got the gnomes instead. Oh wow, and inside here's a card. That's hilarious. So in my swap I just did, I gifted the same exact things. And I was so sad because I didn't buy one for myself. So now I'm so happy you got this one because I didn't get one for myself. And now I have one. Aren't they so cute? These are from Hobby Lobby. The little coffee girls. She got her little clutch, her little handbag. Kiss me under the mistletoe. Isn't that so cute? And then she has gifted... The Land Lakes Hot Chocolate, which I absolutely love. It is so delicious. Um, it's a little hard to find, people were telling me, because I did a tutorial on a box for this. But, um, I mean, I saw it at Target, Walmart. I, I got mine from the base. But, um, 
do it. Anyway, let's get in this. Look at this gorgeous trim. We have some Christmas stripes, um, some beads, some gold cord. I'm going to go ahead and just tie it so that way um, I can keep it on the side when I make a little book thing, which I, I am planning on doing. It may not be this week, though. Warm Christmas wishes. So she chose to do all of Christmas. And she has the cute little um, snowman with some little, um, what do you call this stuff? Nouveau drop gel, glitter gel. Look at the paper. Look at the Santa and the, and the um, what do you call that? Station wagon. And a cute little snowman. And we have all the little candy canes just falling down. So super cute. This may have been her Cricut or maybe stickers. I'm not sure. <clears throat> Excuse me. And on the back, we have some Christmas stickers. We have the little candy canes with the diamonds, the Christmas tree, and the little uh, baubles and bulbs. We have this gorgeous mix that has snow in it. Look at that. It has Christmas trees, well, pine trees, um, snowflakes, uh, peppermints. Look at the little um, penguin in there. We just ha Oh, there's a little snowman. I think it's a snowman, not a penguin. With the little snow. And look at all the little sea beads and stars. Oh, and there's little candy canes. That's a gorgeous mix. Definitely use that. And then we have some organic India Tulsi Focus Hibiscus Cinnamon. Oh, my mom will love that. I'm going to give that one to her. Um, I'm not a huge cinnamon fan, but she love, love, love cinnamon. So I know she's going to love that. I didn't know this was a thing. Mental clarity and cognitive support. Oh, healthy, conscious love. That sounds really good, though. Beautiful job. I love it. I love the little trim thing coming off here. Okay. And thank you for the extra gifts. And definitely, I kind of, okay. I want to be a little selfish. I don't want to bring this upstairs and share it. <laughs> and I want to keep it for my house. Because I know when my mom sees it, she's going to want to keep it. And, you know, I, I, I don't say no to my mom. You know, I don't. So I think I'm going to keep this down here. <laughs> Thank you so much, Julie. And let's get to person number nine. All right. And finishing off today's video is Louise Harris. Look at how gorgeous hers come packaged. I'm going to go ahead and open this one. I don't see any names. And she is Shiba's creation. Okay. Just want to make sure there wasn't any names on there. And, oh my gosh, I'm all discombobulated here. Okay. I like these bags. Okay, let me... I'm trying. Here we go. So on the front, the cutest little tassel on a little fabric pin. She has her little card that's on the inside of those. And it's just her information. Such a cute way to provide your information. It just says thanks. And she Sheba Creations on Facebook and Sheba Create on Instagram. Eat pumpkin pie. Yes. Visit the pumpkin patch. We did that. Um, unfortunately, I am allergic to pumpkins. And so I got to watch from actually the apple orchard. Um, why my niece, my two nieces um, went and uh, picked pumpkins and stuff. So. I got to pick apples. <laughs> oh, there's the cards. Okay. So beautiful, of course. This says believe. This paper is like, I don't know. It feels so, it's like smooth. Of course, you expect it to be rough because it's glitter, but no, it's so smooth. It says enjoy today. So we're going to open her little gift back here. 
Oh, a couple little gifts. Very nice. I love a handmade gift. So she has gifted us a notebook. You know I love an altered notebook any time of the year. So she has some little border strips with some little butterflies and she added little pink um, glitter paper cardstock. Very, very cute. And it looks like on the inside it has um, little butterfly paper on the inside. I don't want to open it because it's packaged super nicely and I want to keep it together. Um, I'm actually getting ready to finish a notebook. I have a ton of them over here. So I'm going to put that in with my other notebooks because I do use them. I use them a lot. And it looks like she has created maybe a little brag book. It says love. It is just a little cute brag book where you can put your um, your pictures. I usually have a stack of pictures right here. Let me see what I got. Do. Um, these are oversized pictures, but you'll get the gist. Do I have any horizontal? I don't. Anyway, so you just pop your little picture in like that. How cute is that? Um, wait, here we go. I got a small picture. So you can just pop your little pictures in, kind of overlap a little bit, make it smaller. How super cute is your little brag book here? Same thing, just put your little, you know, obviously you're going to get like your little 3 by 5 for this space. But how cute is that? So you have your little rainbow page, little stars, super, super cute. Adorable little brag book. This would be perfect right here. How cute is that? What a great gift. I love it. And anytime I can show off my boy, you know. <laughs> That's the scrapbook page I've been supposed to work on since he graduated boot camp, which was like four years ago. So, yeah. Okay, let me package this really nicely back up. Okay. So, her cards. Let's take a look. Oh, so cute. So, we have Hello Fall. Super cute and has like a little, uh, oh, is that cloth? I think that might be a cloth. And she has used some glitter glue on there and a little resin piece with the cutest little um, leaf, like a stem on that one. And she has gifted this really fine silver thread that um, I'm going to go ahead and take this out because I need this right now. <laughs> I was going to go to Hobby Lobby to um, to get some, but <laughs> Louise read my mind. I'm actually going to put it right here because I need it. I only have gold. That was perfect timing. I'm glad I opened this one today. And then look at this little shaker turkey. He has little stars on his belly, and it says, be thankful. He's so cute with a little bead gobble, some little flowers. And on the back, she's added gold. Which I can definitely use that as well. And then, of course, Believe, my favorite, with the little tree. And it has a little snowflake as the star topper. Um, beautiful bow with some gems. And I think that's linen paper, like that, um, it's like, yeah, linen paper on the back that has the glitter. And on the back, she has given us a washi sample and these really cute stars stars snowflakes and my fingers aren't working today i can't get anything open yeah that's that linen paper like a almost it feels like a like a paper napkin look at how cute those stars are very cute thank you so much louise and i think was that three people it was three people. Okay. So let me show you all of theirs together. So Sheba creates Crafting with Julie and um, Crafty underscore Candace. 
Look at me remembering stuff. I probably said it wrong too. <laughs> Look at how gorgeous they are. Thank you ladies so much for just for participating. Um, I don't know if I thanked everyone in the other videos, but thank you everyone who made me one. Um, actually, I think it was a requirement this time. I'm not sure, but I love it. And I'm so excited to put this book together. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.